the message that you're preaching is just one aspect. That is seed. But you need to plow the ground. Okay? Otherwise, you'll be sowing good seed in hard ground. And you'll be wondering why you're preaching the right message. You are saying all the right things. Why, is, why are you not getting the result? Brothers and sisters, it is your tears that you use in wetting the ground. Maybe not enough tears yet. Maybe not enough crying yet. Why? Because your heart is not yet touched. He said, horror had taken hold of me. Why? He said, because of the wicked that keep not your law. Are you touched like that? Do you know what's going to happen to these people? For whom Christ died? Have you ever thought about what hell really means? Do you know what it is for these to be lost? You know, if we, if we allow ourselves to think that ministry has been transformed into business-like uh, operations. You are wrong. Don't, don't, don't deceive yourself by the clothes we are wearing. This is just the out, outside covering. It is not about the preaching. There's something behind the preaching. There's something behind the preaching. Okay? that makes that message to have power, to have life, okay? There's something behind it. And you want to have results, then you've got to pray. And that prayer is born of a relationship that is true, not just because of something you want to see, but because you genuinely, truly love Jesus and his word. Are you following what I'm telling you? 